Hello and welcome to How to Play Five Finger Gunslinger, a game for two players. This game comes to us from thegamecrafter.com. They had a single card challenge where you basically had to have a game that fit on a single standard poker card. And much like the Oscars, the winner of the overall contest, I don't feel was actually the best overall game in that contest. I've covered a few of them and I don't really care that this one won. This game has a single card. It has all the rules on the back, which is what the um, limits of the contest were, uh, that you could not have any more than just a single card. And this is more of a dexterity game where you use one of your five fingers in five rounds to score as many points as possible. You'll lock eyes with your opponent, do a countdown to one, two, three, and then you'll yell out draw. And on draw, both players are going to look at the card and place a finger down. Now, if they get their finger in the entirety of that circle, they get that point. So it can, it can be argued here that North scored a point, but South didn't. But as far as I know, uh, this just wasn't that much of an exciting game. Perhaps maybe with some um, drinking to take place beforehand it might be, but playing it sober, I just did not see the point of it. Now, players can uh, be fast and pull the card towards them, but if your finger misses, you don't get any points. Uh, so that's just the way this goes. But I think we were kind of kind of easy counting on the points here. Other than that, I just it just was not that fun of a game. It somehow won best game of this contest, but I've covered Small Ball, which I think was a superior game. Um, and I've covered some other games. I printed out some other games from this contest to cover. This one just, I don't know, just didn't do for me. And now I know it's a game design contest, so you shouldn't expect gold to come out of uh, 15 minutes of collaboration. But this one, I just think it won simply because it was the easiest game to understand for a lot of people. So we just kept playing this. Uh, use each finger on your hand once. So after three rounds, I've used three fingers. We've scored this many points. And um, you move on to another finger. Perhaps if we played it left-handed, it might have been better. Or on our non-dominant hand, it might have been better. Who knows? All right, so now I got the uh, one point, I think. And so we both managed to get a point. So we'll just uh, write that down and uh, tally up our results so far. Overall, though, I just... For whatever reason, I didn't care too much for this game. I don't think either one of us cared too much for it. But we figured we shot the video. We might as well show it. Uh, let the audience be the judge of it. So if you want to print this up and tell us in the comments what you thought of this game, let us know. So once we've gone through all five fingers, the game should be over at that point. Then the highest score total wins. Um, but yeah, so looks like South managed to win. So yay, I won. So... You know, like always, if you actually want to play this card game in public uh, with other people, you can come to the subreddit card game meetups, or you can just go to a bar and bring it with you. I'm pretty sure this is not going to be too difficult to convince me to do this with you. As far as if it will be fun or not, I don't know. But do click under the show more in the description to get all the links, including to where you can find this game, uh, the links to the music, and a link to a Discord server where we talk about card games all day, every day. It's a fun place. You should definitely be there. Uh, do call your friends and let them know that you'd like to play some cards or dexterity games. They might say yes, and you never know. They might say no, but you never know until you make that phone call. Sometimes you have to be the one to do it. Do like, subscribe, and share these videos with people you know like playing card games. And do vote for this month's Game of the Month. As usual, we only have nine voters. So there's no voter suppression going on. Uh, the polls aren't that difficult to go to. And as usual, nobody likes Liverpool. So go out there and vote, and I'll see you next video.